Good morning friends, it's Sunday. I have already been to the markets. I didn't take you guys because I just wanted to duck in and out and I'm kind of just hanging out. It's really, really good. I really need it. I've been thinking a lot about conditioning today and I think there's so much conditioning around being a weekend warrior and I think it's okay to just chill out. So let's go make some pancakes. Bubba, why you look scared? Because it's windy, yeah? gluten-free pancakes well as a vegan because you can't use eggs to make it stick together. I've been playing around with xanthan or guar gum and it's slightly better but it's still not amazing. I'm still working it out. Kudos to anyone out there who cooks really good gluten-free stuff, gluten-free vegan stuff because it is hard. been thinking about conditioning a lot today and basically as a projector in human design your most intensive conditioning is the productivity wound and what that is is that you feel like your worth is associated with your productivity so I've been actively trying to not do things which goes against like what most other people are like aiming for but because I've been so hyperactive, like not hyperactive in the sense of like my personality, but hyperactive in terms of like what I achieve and what I do and the amount of stuff that I fit into one day. I've been like that my whole life. So now I'm trying to undo it and come back to my normal level, which I'm not really sure what that is, but I'm in the experiment at the moment of figuring that out. So maybe some food for thought for you guys. You don't have to be productive all of the time. In saying that though, I did spend probably an hour this morning researching different cameras and calling stores to upgrade my vlogging setup. So... I just started editing today's vlog and realized that I've been talking about not being productive on your days off. <laughs> And I think it's really good to mention that when you're daily vlogging, like I am at the moment, you don't really get a day off. So even though I feel like I'm being unproductive, I actually am being productive, which goes against what I just said. So I think I have to be more clear about this. I think that the it's the inner feeling, like if you're feeling worthless because you're not achieving or you're not doing things, then that's something that needs rewiring. Not the fact that you're like actually not achieving stuff. Because obviously, if you want to get ahead in life, you've got to do stuff. You've got to achieve. You've got to like 
you know, get out and experience new things and do do what lights you up and like really take action towards things. But your worth is not in what you do. It's in who you are as a person and the way that you do it according to who you are as a person. So I think the productivity wound, it definitely, definitely exists. Like I am living proof that it exists because I have been fighting my whole life to always be on, to always be achieving, to always be doing a million things at once. And now now that I'm like aware of what conditioning actually is, if you don't know what conditioning is, it is the way that you've been molded throughout your life to conform or to, to be a certain way to fit into society rather than living the way that you are designed to live, like your authentic, authentic self and the way that your soul was like put on here to be like the most authentic version of you. And conditioning is like everyone has it, everyone's like has different levels of it, everyone is affected by it differently, everyone has different amounts of conditioning and different types of conditioning depending on where you were brought up, what your experiences are, what your beliefs are, what your parents' beliefs are, what your, like, yeah, everything, what government you were raised under, like all of the things. And it's very good to be aware of what conditioning is and what your specific conditioning is because if you can undo that, you have more potential to expand and to be the most authentic version of you and to stop being a slave to society and stop, stop being a slave to the system. That is the most ideal is to have that freedom of self, self-expression and to be the most authentic version of you. So productivity wound, yes, you do have to do stuff. You do have to achieve. Like I think that, I guess you don't. Maybe you don't have to achieve. I don't know. Let me know in the comments what you think. What do you think about the productivity wound? Because like maybe I'm maybe there's a whole nother level of conditioning there that I haven't quite uncovered yet. But basically, it's the the feeling of being unworthy if you're not doing or achieving is the productivity wound. And I'm trying to undo that in myself. So I hope that that resonated. I'll see you guys tomorrow.